Tuesday, monoballs. What a monoball is is a bearing that replaces a rubber bushing. The reason we want to do that is when we have wide wheels and tires on a car and the car has stickier tires and a lot of grip, the tire has leverage and it pulls on the suspension pieces and distorts the rubber and causes the car to be unstable under both acceleration and braking. And the car kind of just wags its tail and you wind up driving extra hard to keep the car in line when you're going fast, especially on the bumpy country roads that have undulations in them with uneven pavement. Okay. Also, really good brakes put more braking force and distort the rear bushings more and make the car unstable under braking as well. So what we want to do is we want to strengthen these bushings and allow them to support the suspension system and have the car not dance around underneath you. A lot of people make urethane bushings to replace original equipment rubber bushings. The problem with urethane is it doesn't give. How a rubber bushing works is the outside is vulcanized to a metal sleeve and the inside is vulcanized to a shaft and when you twist the two, the sidewall of the rubber bushing moves and that's what allows the suspension to articulate and move. When you make a rubber bushing that's solid, it can't move. They put a sleeve inside of it and what happens is the sleeve chews out the, the urethane and makes the bushing loose over time and it squeaks and makes noise. It's just not a very good use for, a, for a, a something that has to move a lot. It's okay for a sway bar because the sway bar moves very slowly, but a control arm moves very fast and it needs that amount of uh, distance to articulate and move and work effectively as a bushing. So the real solution when you're getting rid of your rubber in your car is go to a bearing. A bearing is like a ball socket. A ball socket moves inside of a nylon housing. The problem with most monoballs is they're not sealed because they're designed for aircraft landing gear or race cars where they get a lot of maintenance. They get dirt in them and again they make clicking and popping noises because they get loose because the dirt chews up the inside liner. So what Dyna does, Dyna makes a, a bearing with a steel ball with a nylon liner in it that has rubber boots on it. Our boots are sealed with little wire clips to keep the dirt out. This gives you complete articulation just like you would with any monoball. No noise like urethane bushing, but a really solid feel that's easy to control. Again, performance out sacrifice because there's no noise with the monoball you get from Dynan.